这样的话，可能到时候稍微做一下彩排，或提醒他们，特别是后面那里做一个调。The average age for first-time pension recipients in Taiwan has decreased in recent years, according to data from the Bureau of Labor Insurance. Currently, the average age stands at 61.28 years old, with 26% of recipients falling between the ages of 55 and 59. Taiwan 的很多产业 The labor force is in high demand across many industries in Taiwan. However, the country's low birth rate and increasing number of baby boomers opting for early retirement has led to a drop in labor force participation. While the need for additional workers is clear, meeting this demand has proven to be a challenging task. France recently experienced riots due to proposed increase of the retirement age from 62 to 64. Similarly, Germany plans to raise the retirement age to 67. In contrast, Taiwan's current retirement age is 63, which is considered relatively early. While there are discussions of increasing it to 65 in the future, it is unclear whether this is sufficient, given the country's demographic challenges and the need to sustain its labor force. Experts warn that if Taiwan were to raise its retirement age to 65, it would still not be enough to cover the shortfall caused by the country's rapidly declining birth rate and the resulting gap in the labor force. This could create significant problems for Taiwan's Bureau of Labor Insurance and the nation's pension funds. Declining labor pensions and insurance payments lead to reduced retirement funds, which is especially worrying as senior employees tend to earn higher salaries and contribute more to the insurance fund due to their longer tenure. As Taiwan continues to move toward a super-age society, the expenses associated with pension funds will only continue to rise, making the future even more challenging for future generations. To address this issue, some experts suggest that Taiwan may need to follow in the footsteps of other countries and consider raising the retirement age as a means to stabilize businesses and the labor force. Chen Wenyue, Zhong Derong, Vivian Xiao, TVBS World Taiwan.